In a previous video, I showed how several word Fast Anywhere users could share the same TM and glossary. In this video, I will show how to use a word Fast Anywhere translation memory and glossary in WordFast Classic. But first, let's see what changes have been made to the remote TM feature in WordFast Classic. In version 6.01G, the remote TM feature is set up under translation memory VLTM. VLTM stands for Very Large Translation Memory. There are two parts in the VLTM, a public portion and a private portion. In order to use the private portion, one must enter a workgroup ID. And if one ticks See Only Workgroup TUs, only units from the private portion will be served when translating in Classic. With version 6.02R and later, the remote feature is set up differently. First of all, the VLTM tab is now labeled Anywhere. Secondly, it is no longer necessary to enter a workgroup ID. Ticking Enable Anywhere TM and Glossaries is sufficient. So how does WordFast Classic knows what private TM it should query? Well, each copy of WordFast Classic downloaded from your account is now stamped with your personal information, which is encrypted inside the program. This is why it is important to use a WordFast Anywhere account with the email address used as your login for the WordFast Classic account at WordFast.net. So I log in with the same email I use at WordFast.net. Here, I have an empty English-French TM as well as a glossary in the same language pair. I will now translate a small text with three segments in order to populate that TM and I will also add some terminology to the glossary. So let's open the document and let's translate it. I'm using Google Translate to save time, so I only need to make a minor change to the first segment. In the second segment, I'm adding a couple of terms to the glossary. I translate the last segment and also add terminology to the glossary. There are now three translation units in the TM and a few term pairs in the glossary. Let's switch to WordFast Classic and translate a similar document in which we should get matches from the Remote Anywhere TM and terminology from the Remote Glossary. On purpose, I'm not using a local TM and I'm not using local glossaries either. I have enabled the Anywhere TM and Glossaries, so I can start translating. For the first segment, I get an 81% fuzzy match from the Anywhere TM, identified as Any. This is the same segment I translated earlier. I can see cat tool was recognized as a, as a glossary term. For the second segment, I also get a fuzzy match and I can see two terms were recognized from the glossary. I also get a fuzzy match from the remote TM and recognized term from the remote glossary. Support for TMs and glossaries hosted in WordFast Anywhere can be very handy for teams of translators as they will have access to the same resources in real time. Some of them can use WordFast Anywhere and some WordFast Classic. Thank you for watching. Do hit that like button down below and also subscribe to my channel for more similar videos. Mm -hmm.